but I have concerns about waking it. Yeah, you've said that a few times now. A normal Krogan is dangerous. This one was created and likely educated by a madman. I see everyone's enjoying the new paperweight. Paperweight! Concerns? We don't know anything about it, Commander. But he said it was perfect. I'm not saying we take a crowbar to it right now, but I'm not giving up a potential resource. It's your decision, Commander. Just be careful. Noted. The cargo hold is safe enough while I decide what to do with him. I mean, they came out as full grown and that one was only alive for a week. So I can only imagine how this like perfect one is. It's designed to be perfect. What's the worst that could happen, right? No idea. So we're back with Mass Effect 2. Oh! Already? First we have to feed the fish. We got... Collectively. Kasumi! Okay, I guess Jacob and Miranda, Melissa, whatever her name is. We got those guys. Kasumi. Zaid. Morden. Archangel. Gare Bear. Gary Berry. Uh, our newest recruits are Jeff. I mean, Jack. <laughs> My name is Jeff. Jack. And the warlord that died and now we have his son. So it's been a very productive time. We have one, two, three, four, five, six fishies. I don't want to know if that's not the maximum amount because I'm going to be really sad. So, uh... We're just going to pretend like that's max. Salvage Krogan pod. Huh. Um, let's take a gander at the briefing room. We've named the fish Susan. Collectively, their names are Susan. You know what? Before we go in there, I want to know what Morden has to say about the Krogan experiment. If anyone knows a thing or two, it's going to be our little space salamander boy. Because he knows a lot of things. Shepard, how can I help? How do you feel about this thing? Have you got a minute to talk? Some other time. About to test new bioweapon. Not on us, of course. Didn't think I had to specify, but Joker got nervous. <laughs> Anything else? Never mind. I'll let you work. We'll be here if you need me. Okay, Morden. <laughs> All right. Shepard, I think we have them. Horizon, one of our colonies in the Terminus systems, just went silent. Oh. If it isn't under attack, it soon will be. Has Morden delivered the countermeasure for the Seeker Swarms? Not yet. Let's hope he works well under pressure. There's something else. His voice sounds know. like AI. One of your former crew, Ashley Williams. She's stationed on Horizon. Ashley. Oh! The Caden counterpart. I haven't heard that name in years. Last I knew, Ash was Alliance. Why is she out in the Terminus systems? Officially, it's an outreach program to improve Alliance relation with the colonies. But they're up to something. And if they sent Chief Williams, it must be big. Chief Williams. Perhaps you should take it up with her. The Collectors just happened to pick a colony with one of my former crew. I don't buy yeah, this isn't a trap. It shouldn't be a surprise the collectors are interested in you, especially if they're working for the Reapers. They might be going after her to get to you. We should send a message to the Citadel. The Alliance can give us reinforcements. Not until you investigate. I don't want the Alliance getting in our way. Once you have the situation under control, I'll send the message personally. All right, I'm ready to move. Send the coordinates. We'll head straight Let's there. Let's fucking go. This is the most warning we've ever had, Shepard. Good luck. 
I don't necessarily trust it. They're targeting something with a one of my former. Joker set a course for Horizon. I've got to go see the professor. Crewmates. Hmm. What the? It's Morden time. Tell me you have something. Is that a smile? Yes. Oh. Lilith, we've got a problem. Still can't calibrate the targeting matrix? Those defense towers are useless if we don't figure it out. Sorry, Chief. Getting our comm systems back online... This is priority. interesting. Yeah. Okay. Surprised people haven't tried to blame that one on me, too. People out here don't trust the Alliance. I wonder what it would have been like if Caden was alive. What is that? Oh, space whale. Get everyone to the safe house. Oh shit. I'll cover you. Run. They're here. No. That's why he was studying the bugs. Go, 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 go. Oh no. Deploy the countermeasures. Oh no. Not the titties. So they do like a light sedative on them, like a paralysis. And they sweep him up. I hate these things. I don't like bugs. The only good bug is a dead bug. Hey, look at those little arms. How do you press buttons with those things? The fuck? Assuming control. Oh, they've got hive mind. Of course they do. Of course you could conveniently tap into any bug boy you want. We are the harbinger of their perfection. Harbinger. Dude, you don't want humans. Leave them alone. They're squishy, weak. Like, you got so many other options. Hmm. Why does she have the red ring around her feet? Is that just like normal and I didn't notice it? Probably. Hmm. Okay. We're going to Bug Planet. We're gonna need some fire power. I'm gonna go and bring the bug boys. The little alien boys. We got one tech proficient badass and one weapon badass. I feel disloyal because I don't have like a set crew I've been rolling with on every mission, you know? I wonder how you guys play this game. Gordon, you sure these armor upgrades will protect us from the seeker swarms? Certainty impossible, but in limited numbers, should confused detection make us invisible to swarms? In theory. Okay. In theory? That sounds promising. Experimental technology. Only test is contact with seeker swarms. Have to test them in person. <laughs> should be exciting. 
in theory. Dude, I, okay, something that's really impressive about this game that I have not talked about enough is the amount of dialogue options and the amount of voice recordings the actors had to do. Because there's like countless possibilities, right? Of screw, like crew members and squad members that could go on every mission. So you have to have different dialogue and like story, witty commentary recorded for every single possible outcome of dialogue for each planet, for each mission. Like that's wild. That is insane. The amount of effort that goes into this is wild. And you don't even think about it, right? Cause you're just like, oh, I'll choose this character and this character. And they're just naturally gonna say some shit behind me. But like there has to be dialogue for every single person you could possibly take on a mission. That's insane. Insane. Yeah, but also I'm curious to see if you guys like went with like one squad the whole time. I'm sure I'll like pick and choose favorites as we continue like we and we progress further into the story, but um, or did you guys just like hop around the whole time? I don't know. You probably like gravitate towards some characters more than others as you get to know them, but I don't know. I think we ultimately ran with Liara and Garrus a lot last time, but I don't know. It was kind of all over the bag. I've got no shield. That was fast. Okay. Oh my god, that's a lot of bug boys. Like, it's nothing personal. I just want to pick who's going to make sense for the kind of stuff we're doing, you know? It's not favoritism, it's just common sense. Ew. Not meaning that in a pompous kind of way. Not like, yeah, it's just common sense. Like, you can play the game however you want to play. It's just like, I'm just going with what my gut says. Which has been wrong, so... Blue, orange, white. Orange, blue, orange, blue. Fuck. Orange, white, orange. Come on. Whew. Nice. Hey. Commander, we're getting a interference. We can't maintain the Collector ship disrupting communications. We're on our own now. Yikes. I feel like we're playing Apex Legends. Heavy fire imminent. Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, and there's, like, husks. And they're using Mass Effect shields. There are husks. Collectors and... Geth? This should slow him down. Let's go, Morden. Nice. Those things look like the husks the Geth used on Eden Prime. That's what I'm saying. I thought the Geth got that technology from Sovereign. Elusive Man was right. Collectors working with Reapers. Mm-hmm. That's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. I was like, oh, Geth? Husks? That's this. Heavy skin. Ooh. That'd be dope. Mm, husks have human characteristics, possibly repurposed colonists. No. The Geth impaled their victims on giant spikes to turn them into husks. But we haven't seen any. The collectors must have already had the husks. They want the colonists alive for something else. Collectors must be experimenting on the colonists. What are they up to? Maybe it's better not to know the details. Find out for sure when you stop them. These aren't the same creatures I fought on Eden Prime. They're more advanced. Evolved. Mm -hmm. They still die if you shoot them. True. <laughs> 
collectors aren't getting away with more victims. Let's move out. Let's go. These do look a little bit more advanced. The other ones look like zombies. These look more like cyberpunky. Vamos. All these empty buildings. It's unsettling. The music no is so freaky. I don't like this. Don't shoot your laser at me. Oh, this is not the time. But okay. They made this easy for me, thank god. They put all of them right next to each other. Amazing. Ew. Let's take a gander at all these little buildings. I'm sure there's secret stuff all around. Stasis colonists. Oh, we get to explore their uh, state. Ew. That's Garrus. Who's out there making noises? You stop that. Ew. Where's the static colonist? Oh, ew. Got no shield. I hate these noises. And stay down. Stinky. Where's the? Ah. I was on the complete other side. Do I have to go around. We have to go all the way around. Wee. Victim appears conscious, fully aware, mm -hmm. trapped in stasis. Fascinating. They've been like this a long time. Hmm. Did they just forget to pick these ones up? Or they didn't need any more? They met their quota. Interesting. White, orange, white. Oh, fuck. Green. White. Orange, white, orange. Yay! Hmm. Was that the end of this one? Particle beam? Ooh! Collect your particle beam acquired. Following squad members are now able to use it. Shepard. Oh my. Oh my. Ew. Oh. What? I am assuming. Hey, yo, okay, imagine, hear me out. Imagine, as the general, you can warp in at any time, right? Imagine some of the collectors are with a, with a woman, with a lady, or, or, you know, or with whoever, and then, like, you can just, like, 
happen. You know what I'm saying? Like you're in the middle of getting some, you're getting freaky, and then the collector general can just like boop, and like steal that moment and just. I was just saying. I'm just saying. The collector can smash, dude. You guys ever think about that? Taking heavy fire. No, just me. Is that not the first thing you guys thought of? Cannot stop us, Shepard. If I must turn to our Shepard, I will. Just the thing to help. This is This is fun. But like, hear me out. This thing is insane. What the fuck? You can't see me. Changes nothing, Shepard. This is sick. Hell yeah, brother. I don't know how we got here. Maybe we came from this direction? I honestly... Okay. We need to go that way. Mayhaps. There's a lot of inconvenient times you could zap, you know? You're about to dig into a really yummy pizza? Boom. I don't know. That's my wife! Hey! Wow, honey, that was a lot better than usual! <laughs> Did you try something new? the general the whole time. <laughs> oh, no. Extensive therapy required. <laughs> Company. Get out here. Now. Who's this guy? You're... You're human. What are you doing out here? You need them right here. What are you doing out here? It's Uncle Vinny. You had to hear them trying to get in. Seems like it's hard to hide from the collectors. Those things are collectors? You mean they're real? <laughs> I thought they were just made up, you know, propaganda to keep us in Alliance space. No, oh, they got Lilith. I, I saw her go down. Sten, too. They, they got damn near everybody. I, need I don't care who he is. Against. Tell me everything you remember. We lost our comm signals a few hours ago. I came down to check on the main grid. And I heard screaming. This is Danny DeVito. Outside, there were swarms of bugs. The voice actor. Every room they touched just froze. I, I, I sealed the doors. Damn it, it, it's the Alliance's fault. They stationed that Chief Williams here and built those defense towers. It made us a target. Hmm. Tell me more about this Alliance rep. Chief Williams? Heard she was some kind of hero or something. Oh. That mean nothing to me, though. Would have rather she just stayed back in council space. Damn. Any idea what she was doing on Horizon? Supposed to be helping us get the defense towers up and running. I got the feeling she was here for something else. Spying on us, maybe. Tell me about the colony defense towers. A gift from the Alliance. High-powered Guardian lasers. Supposed to keep hostile ships from landing near the colony. Had to build a massive underground generator just to give it enough juice. Only we couldn't get the targeting systems online. So the Alliance gave us a giant gun that couldn't shoot straight. Stupid sons of bitches. Where are they being holed up? 
Are they just like imprisoned in this giant alien ship? Why do you think this is the Alliance's fault? We're just a small colony. Nobody bothered us before we started building those damn defense towers and drew attention to ourselves. I left Council Space to get away from the Alliance. Nothing good ever comes from getting mixed up with them. That's fair. The Alliance doesn't care about the Terminus colonies. Yikes. Damn straight. That's what I tried to tell everybody. I mean... The Alliance didn't send someone out here because they want to help us. They were after something. Always are. I don't want to... I don't want to point fingers, but... If you have defenses, we can use them against the Collector ship. You'd need to calibrate the targeting system first. Oh, Garrus is here. He's always calibrating. It be hard to figure out. Just need the location. Head for the main transmitter on the other side of the colony. Pretty hard to miss. The targeting controls are at the base. Do I want to get this guy killed? We kind of need him, right? I don't know. Garrus is the calibrations guy. You know this colony and the equipment. You better come with us. Not a chance in hell. Uh, if I call him a coward and he dies, I'll feel bad. You'd probably just get in the way. Yeah, that's what I was thinking too. I'll let you out, but I'm locking the door behind you. I'm not taking any. He chances. could also die here too. Good luck. I think you're gonna need it. I mean, it is what it is, you know. If I get this guy killed, uh... oh, weapons locker. That's always good. Yikes! It's about to get serious. Here we go. Hostiles to the right. Enjoy it. Intervention is necessary. Oh God, he's tapping in, boys. We are the harbinger of your destiny. Owie. He's tapping in. punch these guys how effective is that probably not very effective right how to find out oh my god explosive container that works where are you at i mean that wasn't bad deploying incineration tech Scion, what the hell? The humanoid appearance. Ew. Is that what was making that god awful it's sound? We haven't run across more frozen colonists. Colonists loaded onto ship. Collectors nearly finished here. Need to hurry. What the heck? There's so many corridors here. This back door? Oof, here we go. God, explosive canister there. Here we go. This is about to be a big boss fight. Yep, there's the music. Oh my god. That's awful. Ew. I don't think I like that gun very much. Bro! Enemies on our right! 
just gonna hole up. Thank you for doing that, Garrus. Hmm. If you shoot their le legs, what? What the heck? Stop it. Stop it. Where's this pewter? White, orange, white. Green, white, green. White, orange, white. Or orange, white, orange. Yeah. Normandy, do you copy? Joker here. Signal's weak, Commander, but we got you. Oh, if we didn't hack this, we wouldn't have help? Time to show these things we give as good as we get. Edie. Bring the defense towers online. Oh. Errors in the calibration software are easily rectified, but it will take time to bring the towers to full power. That's fine. I recommend a defensive posture. I will not be able to mask the increased generator output. That's fine. Collectors will respond with force to stop it. We'll stop them. Easy enough. Maybe not. Enemy reinforcements closing in. I suggest you ready weapons. Oh my god! What the? Dude, that guy just flew in here. Ah! He's zapping! Attacks will tear you apart. Neutralize Commander Shepard. Bonk. Nothing stands against us. Owie. I'm on fire. Fuck. That wasn't too bad. I was just, my position was ass. Quite honestly. I was just like standing in the middle. It's pretty butt cheeks. That guy fell in and died last time. That was pretty funny. Maybe I can just. Oh, I can't go in here. Assuming direct control. Dying. Ye Come here, you stinky. Stinky bug. Stink bug. You got another wave? The enemy has withdrawn. Reinforcements likely. Yeah. Oh my 
my god. Shut up. If I must tear you apart, Shepard, I will. Firing on impact shot. Let's go. Come on, come on, come on. Yeah. Oh no, Garrus died. He's good. 60%? Alright, let's go. Get ready. Gotta be more soon. I need some ammo. Oh. Oh god. Are those souls? Those are what the frick? Maybe we need that system online. Those are bodies in its mouth. Whatever it is, don't get too close. Okay, maybe not right now. Come on, it's time. Oh my god, it's dancing! Oh god, he's like, I can laser back! I need some ammo. Shit. It's barriers all the way back up again? Stop it. You fool! doing so well oh man I just wanted that piece of ammo Oh my god. It's freaking out. Uh particle beam. Come on. Owie, wowie. Run, 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 run. This again? Breathe, Shep. Breathe. Praetorian. Can you not? Can you not? Ah! No abilities up. Come on. Oh, of course. Spray and pray, baby. Oh my god, it's shaking! Collector time, collector time, collector time. Particle beam, particle beam. Incendiary. Fuck. God bless. Okay, it just turned into dust. Okay. They're pulling out. No! Don't let him get away. That ship is huge. Exactly how are we supposed to catch it? Half the colony's in there. They took Egan and Sam and, and Lilith. Do something. I did my best. You just hid in your damn bunker. 
Uh, if it wasn't for Shepard, you'd all be on board that ship. Shepard? Wait. I know that name. Oh, do you know? Sure, I remember you. You're some type of big alliance hero. Oh! Commander <gasps> Shepard, captain of the Normandy, the first human specter, savior of the Citadel. You're in the presence of a god, Delan, back from the dead. Ah! Oh, the good people we lost, and you get left behind. Figures. Oh my god. Screw this. I'm done with you alliance types. <laughs> what does this guy think he is? I thought you were dead, Commander. We all did. Aw, she's grown up. It's been too long, Ash. How have you been? The music! You show up after two years and act like nothing's happened? I would have followed you anywhere, Commander. I thought you were gone. I... You were more than our Commander. Why didn't you try to contact me? Why didn't you let me know you were alive? I was dead. Not my choice. I spent the last two years in some kind of coma while Cerberus rebuilt me. You're with Cerberus now? Oh, Garrus God. Too. I can't believe the reports were right. Reports? You mean you already knew? Alliance Intel said Cerberus could be behind our missing colonies. They got a tip that this one could be the next to get hit. What? I went to Anderson, but he Alliance talk, is so stupid. There were rumors that you weren't dead. Worse, that you were working Cerberus is behind the attacks? I guess we do show up after them. Cerberus and I want the same thing. To save our colonies. That doesn't mean I answer to them. Do you really believe that? Or is that just what Cerberus wants you to think? Dude, it's been I a couple years. that you were alive. I just never expected anything like Why this. Why is she like cross-eyed? You've turned your back on everything we stood for. Ash, you know me. You know I'd only do this for the right reason. You saw it yourself. The Collectors are targeting human colonies, and they're working with the Reapers. I'd like to believe you, Shepard, but I don't trust Cerberus. And it worries me that you do. What did they do to you? Brought me back what to if life? Behind it? What if they're the ones working with the Collectors? Damn it, Williams. You're so focused on Cerberus that you're ignoring the real threat. Dude. I can see you won't listen to reason. You show up after two years and tell me you're working with Cerberus. Sounds like you left reason behind a long time ago. Doesn't matter. I still know where my loyalties lie. I'm an Alliance soldier. This is not it's in my blood. Going as well as I thought it would. I'm reporting back to the Citadel. I'll let them decide if they believe your story. I could use someone like you and my crew, Ash. Be just like old yeah, times. that's not happening. No, it won't. I'm no fan of aliens, but Cerberus has a history of being extremist. I'll never work for a group like that. So long, Commander. Good luck. Damn, dude. Can't wait for this to backfire on her and her to get shit on. Good luck, girly! Joker, send the shuttle to pick us up. I've had enough of this colony. That's awkward. That's awkward. Escape of approximately one third of Horizon's population. Front Corporation with funnel supplies, monetary aid to colonial survivors. Collector leader Harbinger demonstrates a personal interest in Shepard. Unclear whether his ability to possess his minions is cybernetic override. Indication of hive mind among collectors. That's what I said. Or even Reaper technology at work. Salvage teams captured collector bodies for study. Nice. We got some bodies and a new heavy. Focused radiation weapon is effective against shields, barriers, and armor. Hell yeah. And then we got the lattice shunting shield. Plus 20 health. Some shmoneys and platinum. Shepard, good work on Horizon. Hopefully the collectors will think twice before attacking another colony. Hmm. That was our first strike. How do we find them the next time? Ashley, the man. will be more careful now, but I think we can find another way to lure them in. Hmm. Or the defensive tower. Wait, what? I wondered if you had something to do with that attack. Ash said the Alliance got a tip about me and yeah. Cerberus. 
I released a few carefully disguised rumors that you might be alive and working for Cerberus. I see. What were you trying to prove? I suspected the collectors were looking for you or people connected to you. Now I know for certain. Yikes. It was a risk, but I couldn't just wait for them to take another colony. You understand? I mean, yeah. Yeah, it's like your only shot, but we need a plan. What's our next step? We have to keep the pressure on the collectors. They'll be more cautious with their ground operations. So we need another opening. I'm devoting all resources to finding a way through the Omega-4 relay. We have to hit them where they live. Oh! Your team will need to be strong, as will their resolve. There's no looking back. The same goes for you. Can I assume you put your past relationships behind you? I mean... Homegirl was literally like, I don't like aliens. I hate everyone. But you, you've gone too far. You've gone too far, Shepard. It was hard to see Ashley again. And now it's done. Best to leave those connections behind and focus on our mission. Shepard, once you find a way through the Omega-4 relay to the Collector homeworld, there's no guarantee you'll return. To have any hope of surviving, you and your entire team must be fully committed to this. We're good. Thanks for the pep talk, but we'll be fine. I've forwarded three more dossiers. Keep building your team while I find a way through. Yay, the more dossiers. Be careful, Shepard. The collectors will be watching you. Nice. Heck yeah, brother. Oh, Jacob. Goody. I guess we're really going to do it. Hit the Omega-4 relay. We're going to need some backup. The collectors in person. Looking forward to the action. After seeing what those bastards did on Horizon, though, it makes you think. Yeah. They're powerful, but we've got a few tricks for them. If anyone can stop them, we can. No argument there, Commander. Horizon just made it hit home. What we're doing, what we're up against. Mm. Gonna go take care of a little unfinished business. I imagine everyone else is, too. Getting some closure, you know? This is their very open way of telling us that the Omega-4 is a thane. Uh, past the point of no return quest. Got it! Loud and clear. Samara. Got it. Hey, Strum and the Geth controlled Dolan. Dude, we got some... Alliance headquarters? Oh. Incoming message from Admiral Stephen Hack at Alliance HQ. Commander Shepard, I need to discuss a sensitive matter with you privately. I'll take this in my quarters. <laughs> Alright, I gotta feed my fish anyways. Hey, you should uh, wrap up any close ends or loose ends. Hey, uh, everyone's saying bye to their loved ones. Uh, this may be a past the point of no return quest. Commander, thank you for your time. I'll keep this brief. We have a deep cover operative out in Batarian space. Name's Dr. Amanda Kenson. Dr. Kenson recently reported that she found evidence of an imminent Reaper invasion. Oh, you don't fucking say, mate! So why call me? Yeah! This morning I received word that the Batarians arrested her. They're holding her in a secret prison. Oh! Post on now you call charges. mommy! I need you to infiltrate the prison and get her out of there. As a favor to me, I'm asking you to go in alone. That's a setup. What? I know we're good with Hackett, but like the Alliance and we need to go in alone to do this mission regarding Reapers at this time? What's Dr. Kenson actually doing out there? She's a deep cover operative, Shepard. We talk only when we have to. Do I believe I this guy? She was investigating a rumor of a Reaper artifact in the system. Her last report said she'd found it. What else can you tell me about the operative? Amanda's a top scientist and an Alliance agent working in Batarian space. It's a deadly assignment, and she's one of the few up to the challenge. She and I go back pretty far, Commander. I won't let her run away in a Batarian torture camp. Can I have her file? Is she real? I thought the Alliance denies the Reaper threat. That must be some proof she found. Kenson's team found an artifact out in Batarian space. 
She believes it's a Reaper device, proof that the Reapers are indeed planning to invade. I've known her a long time. If she says she has proof, it's worth checking out. Okay, so this random bitch who says she's found proof that the Reapers are real versus me literally dying to a Reaper invasion wasn't proof enough? Me dying, coming back two years later and being like, hey, yo, the Reapers, we're here. But oh, Amanda, sorry, Dr. Amanda has proof that the Reapers are real. I'm just a little salty. I have a hell of a squad with me. I'm sure they'd help out. Kenson is my friend. If the Batarians see a squad of armed soldiers, they'll kill her. This is serious, Commander. Go in with discretion, or don't go at all. Hmm. The Batarians won't take kindly to the Alliance breaking into a secret prison. This is not an Alliance operation. It's one person going in alone to save a friend. If it were an official mission, of course the Batarians would be upset. Hmm. You keep this quiet, Shepard, and there's nothing to worry about. All right. I'll make this a priority. The prison is hidden underground at a Batarian outpost in Aratat. All right. I'll upload the coordinates now. Once she's secure, confirm her discovery. We'll debrief you when you're back. Got it. Hack it out. Huh. And he wanted me to do this in private? I mean, I get it. Concealing the whole Reapers thing, the proof thing. Hmm. Fishies. Uh. Well, I don't have to do that mission. Good thing the Reapers are fake, just like the moon landing. Anyways. Shepard, the tank you recovered from Corliss indicates stable Krogan life signs inside. It is in the cargo bay should you wish to investigate. Sick. Shadow Broker intel. We're aware that your old friend Liard Sioni has been hunting for the Shadow Broker for several years. We wouldn't mind helping her in the hunt, given the broker's past work for the collectors. We recently uncovered some information that might give Liara a lead on where to find the Shadow Broker's base of operations, but unfortunately she doesn't have much faith in Cerberus intel. If you'd visit Ilium and pass it on to her as a gesture of goodwill, we'd appreciate it. Oh? Can you help? Commander, the Alliance soldier here gave me this contact information. I hope this reaches you. You said you were trying to stop these collectors. They took my son and brother. Have you found them? Do you know where they are? I know you're looking, but so many people are just gone. Every family lost someone. Children are the worst. Empty desks at schools. Winter clothes that never got worn. Please, the Alliance isn't doing anything. The Council isn't doing anything. You can find our people. I'm begging you to do something. Tell me something I can do. Tell me anything. Ew. Well, you guys already know I'm going to make Liara a priority here, but I will go check out this Krogan pod. Little egg boy. I'm assuming he's in... Wait. The sub deck? Y'all already know I'm going to go get Liara, but... Uh... Yeah, I guess Jack wouldn't like the Krogan in her, uh, nest. So, Kenneth, did you know we've got a crazy woman squatting down in the sub-deck? What? If she touches anything, I'll kill her. Oh, and the only thing she wears from her waist up is tattoos. Oh, maybe I should go down and welcome her. Ha <laughs> ha! And she's a murderer, has biotic powers that could crush you with a blink, hates everyone in Cerberus. Damn it, girl, stop toying with me. Ha <laughs> True. Maybe I should uh, go in and welcome her, you know? Hey, yo. <laughs> Cargo. Oh. Breeding pod. The subject is stable, Shepard. Integration with onboard systems was seamless. Is he, uh, where? Can he see anything in there? Does he know where he is? Unlikely. Current neural patterns indicate minimal cognition. Same. Barring shipwide power loss, the nutrients in the tank could sustain him for over a year. Any idea how dangerous this guy is? He is a Krogan, Shepard. If you were asking whether he is actively hostile, 
I don't have the necessary data to answer. Okir's technology could impart data, not methods of thinking. The subject may know of his views, but would not necessarily share them. What can you tell me about this guy? Anything unusual? The subject is an exceptional example of the Krogan species, with fully formed primary, secondary, and tertiary organs where applicable. Oh? No defects of any kind, aside from the genetic markers of the genophage present in all Krogan. I cannot judge mental functioning. Sick. Fuck Stand it. by. I'm gonna open the tank and let him out. Cerberus protocol is very clear regarding untested alien technology. Eh, fuck it. Either a powerful addition to the crew or a time bomb. I'd rather deal with it now. Very well, Shepard. The controls are online. The switch and consequences are yours. Hatch, my child. He is our son now. I am your mama. Be born! He comes out, his voice, instead of being like, Hey, I'm a Krogan, it's gonna be like, Mama! <laughs> I'm just a little Krogan. Just a little guy. Female, before you die, I need a name. Mama! I'm Commander Shepard, and I don't take threats lightly. I suggest you relax. Not your name, mine. I'm trained, oh. I know things. But the tank, Okir couldn't implant connection. His words are hollow. Warlord, legacy, grunt. Grunt. Grunt was among the last. It has no meaning. It'll do. I am Grunt. I am Groot. You are worthy of your command. Prove your strength and try to destroy me. Why do you want me to try to kill you? Want? I do what I'm meant to. Fight and reveal the strongest. Nothing in the tank ever asked what I want. I feel nothing for Okir's clan or his enemies. That imprint failed. He has failed. Without a reason that's mine, one fight is as good as any other. Might as well start with you. Oh, this guy is a hoot at parties. I took you and I released you. Follow my command and you'll have purpose. Nothing in the tank imprints indicated humans could be so forceful. You command as though you've earned it. His little lip movement. My enemies threaten galaxies. Everyone on my ship has earned their place. Hmm. Hmm. That's acceptable. I'll fight for you. Yay! Well, reason. Wow, that was easy. <laughs> Offer one hand, but arm the other. Why, Shepard? If I find a clan, if I find what I, I want, I will be honored to eventually pit them against you. <laughs> Wow. Charming. Shepard. Just checking in. Making sure you're acclimatizing. Humans talk too much. Like the tank. Come back later. Okay. That's all for now. Shepard. <laughs> okay. I'm about to get... I'm about to get in trouble with the invisible man. I'm gonna get spanked. Oh no! Let's see what Miranda has to say. Oh, I can't wait. I'm seething. What's wrong? They lost contact with New Kent. Oh, another one? Might be the collectors. Did your family get out of there? I don't know. There's no communications yet. I'm sure they're safe. You, you'll see. Yikes. Um. Did you hear? Another colony went missing. Ferris Fields. Ferris Fields? Didn't Hadley have a brother stationed there? Yeah. He's taking it pretty hard. Aw, oh, man. Oh, boy. Here we go. Shepard, 
I find myself in the unpleasant position of asking for your help. I don't like discussing personal matters, but this is important. What's going on? She has personal matters? Do you remember what I told you about father? Building a dynasty? There was another reason I went to Cerberus for protection. I have a sister, a twin, and he's still hunting her. Cerberus has kept her safe. Twins. Until now. She's living a normal life on Ilium, safe and hidden from my father. So why are you sharing the family history with me? My father's agents have been searching for my sister for years. I believe they've tracked her to Ilium. I've tried to keep her hidden without impacting her life, but I'm out of options. He's too close. I need to relocate my sister's family before it's too late. What do you know about your sister? She's my genetic twin. We're identical. Auga. But she deserves a normal life, and she's going to get it no matter what. <laughs> Did your sister's family know about this? Are they okay with being relocated? They know nothing. They're completely uninvolved. Normal. I told Cerberus and they're coming up with a positive reason to move the family. She has a normal sister. Genetically equal to her? Miranda is unnormal. There's no way her twin sister is normal. Sure, I can help. What's better than one Miranda? Two Mirandas! What do you need me to do? My father is extremely persistent. I'd like to go to Ilium when Cerberus is moving the family to make sure none of his agents get too close. My contact's name is Lantea. She'll be waiting for us in the lounge near the Nurse Astra docking bay. Okay. Okay. Two Mirandas. Might as well talk to everyone else. Hello, Gewis. Need me for something? Have you got a minute? Can it wait for a bit? I'm in the middle of some calibrations. <gasps> Classic! <laughs> Talk to you later, Garrus. I'll be here if you need me. <laughs> okay. Liara time! Where's our girl? You've received a new message at your private terminal. Encrypted from Elusive Man. Shepard, I see you awakened Okir's Krogan. A dangerous decision, but you've got free reign on this operation. If you're certain he'll be a useful member of the team, you've got my support. We need every weapon we can in this battle. If this grunt proves unreliable and has to be put down, don't lose the body. He's based at least partially on collector technology and could offer useful genetic data. But again, you are in charge. Okay. Nice. We didn't get in trouble. Not even a slap on the wrist. Too easy. Horizon. God, this is the best quality of life improvement, I swear. I want to do the Citadel at some point, but we're going to do Liara first. <laughs> Get Liara back is what I meant. Was she on Amun? Amun? Hmm. I think she was on Amun. Oh, God. Oh, God, I'm so lost in the sauce. Uh... I really don't feel like backing out and looking at my journal, so we're gonna Google it! Ilium? Mm. 
Where is... Ilium? No, Sastra. Milky Way, Crescent Nebula, Second Planet. Uh... 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 Close to the mass relay? Okay, I'm just gonna listen to you guys. Back we go. Um. Unexplored. Says Crescent Nebula, give Liara Intel. What? I was in the wrong system entirely. Big dummy energy. <laughs> okay. Ilium. Ilium is a classic garden world developed to serve as an interpot between the Terminus systems and the Asari republics. To abet this trade, the normally stringent custom laws of Council Space on product safety, prescribed materials, and sapient trafficking are relaxed. Officially, Ilium is not an Asari world, it is colonized and operated by Asari corporate interests. This gives it the same legal latitude enjoyed by the human corporate research enclaves of Novaria. Ilium is one of the youngest Asari colonies settled during the seventh expansion wave. The first child born on the world is only now reaching her middle age. The world is hot and massive, ground settlement is only possible at the higher polar latitudes. In more equatorial locations, the population is housed in arcology skyscrapers to heat- to escape the heat of the surface! Sounds pretty! Wow, and it's not old? It's like a, an Asari safe haven. Auga. Sounds like it's gonna be a good time! Gwunt. I don't want to bring Gare Bear because I don't want him to get jealous of Liara. Grunt. Can you change who you romanced in the first one? Not that I'm considering it. Unless. I'm gonna bring Grunt and Jack. I feel like that's gonna be fun. All of these are so good. I love the abilities in this one. God. Jack is a beautiful specimen. Oh. Welcome to Nosastra, Commander Shepard. We've been instructed to waive all docking and administration fees for your visit. Hell yeah. My name is Karina. If you need information about the area, it would be my pleasure to assist you. Who instructed you to waive the fees? The order came from Liara Tassoni, who paid all fees on your behalf. She also asked that I direct you to speak with her at your convenience. She's near the trading floor. Hey, 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 hey. What can you tell me about Nosastra? It's an exciting city. We see a lot of new cultures and goods because of our proximity to the Terminus systems. At the same time, Ilium is still in a sorry world. You should be as safe here as you would be on the Citadel. For your own safety, however, I recommend against signing anything. What's so dangerous about signing something? Ilium is a free trade world commander. 
Contract term requirements are more relaxed here than on other planets. It's a small price to pay for keeping our competitive edge in goods from the Terminus systems. Huh. Do you have any recommendations about what to do on Nosastra? Our trading center is directly ahead. You'll find restaurants and shops nearby as well. That's awesome. They added so many things. Shopping kiosks. You can find things on Nosastra that you can't find anywhere else in the galaxy. They added Omega, Nosastra. That's awesome. Previously, we just had like the Citadel, basically. This is rad. You said Liara was here? What is she doing? Liara is one of Nosastra's most respected information brokers. Yeah. Nosastra is based upon trade. Information is valuable currency, and Liara has done quite well. As I said, you'll find her near the trading floor. She was looking forward to seeing you. I'm on a mission. Can you help me find someone? I can help you find major entertainment centers or stores, but I'm afraid I can't point you to individual people. Liara is excellent at that type of work, however. I imagine she can help you. Wonderful. Thank you. Again, welcome to our city, Commander. Please enjoy your stay. Amazing. Customs records indicated just a car named Samara is visiting this port, Shepard. Your former teammate, Liara Tassoni, may have more information. Her office overlooks the trading floor. You may wish to speak with her regarding the whereabouts of Thane Krios, the assassin on your dossier. Ah, multiple birds with one stone, eh? Liara. Tally! Combat tech system. Formerly, this is as Tali Zora Naraya. The Quarian engineer earned her an adult name after helping Shepard defeat Saren two years ago. Oh, Tali Zora Vas Nima. Currently on a classified assignment for the Migrant Fleet Admiral Admiralty Board on Haystrom in the Geth controlled space. Samara was seen on Ilium. Thane, rumored to have a target on Ilium. Cerberus has delivered information on purchases the Shadow Broker has made. Oh, information Liara needs to track down the Shadow Broker. Miranda's... Oh, need to get to Ilium. Oh. Has a personal matter he wishes to discuss. Fuck that. Anyways. <laughs> uh, can I switch my squad real quick? There's like 20 things going on here. Sure. Wow. All right. This is really pretty. Tired of training employees only to lose them to your competitors? Perhaps Indenture Tech can help. The leading provider of cutting edge indentured service, Indenture Tech can provide contract guaranteed labor for any technical error. <laughs> What? Tired? Tired of people leaving you? Just enslave them. What? That's wild. You have to give the Asari credit. Ilium is a cultural marvel. Humanity can learn a lot from their ingenuity. This is crazy. No Sastra exchange. This is awesome. No, you don't understand. I lost it somewhere near the transport terminal. It can't be replaced. It's a token from my bond mate. It's the only thing my child has to remember her father by. Please, if you find it. No, I, I, I understand. Where is that coming from? Downstairs? Two years since the destruction of the Destiny Ascension, planning for the fleet of the new Allied Citadel Defense Unit. 25. Sell at 25. No, no, no. You're not hearing me. I want to buy it up. Buy it all up. Come on, come on. Give me something. Excuse me. Excuse me. You're Commander Shepard. I saw your... I guess you would say your aura. My aura? I'd recognize you anywhere. Hey, girl, you got a nice aura. I was asked to give you a message if I saw you. It's from a friend you made on Novaria. I met a lot of people on Novaria. Could you be more specific? I believe the message itself should make it clear. Shepard, we hide. We the Reconite Queen! We build. But we know that you seek those who soured the songs of our mothers. When the time comes, our voice will join with yours. 
and our crescendo will burn the darkness clean. Thank you, Shepard. The Rachni will sing again. This is a horror game. Because of you. I'm glad to hear that you're rebuilding. Are you somewhere close by? The Rachni Queen is not here. That message is one of many memories I carry from her. I encountered her on an uncharted world. She saved my life. What were you doing More there? Than that, she gave me a purpose. They are an amazing people, Shepard. The galaxy owes you a great debt for giving them a second chance. You're welcome. I was not going to let the bugs live, but you know what? How did you find the Rachni? Yeah, that's my I was question. Working as a courier. Pirates ambushed my ship, and I was forced down on an uncharted planet. I was badly injured, alone and near death. Then they found me. They saved me. You obviously got off world again. Did the Rachni give you a ship? No. Countless workers repaired my ship. It runs better now than it did oh, before. Oh, the Rachni did? They remind me of the keepers on the Citadel. Ah, in way. resourceful. All working together, each with a purpose. You said the Queen gave you a purpose. What do you mean? The Queen shared her song with me as I recovered. I saw the Rachni as only an Asari could. She did say... They were so beautiful and so vulnerable. They would sing their song again. They needed someone so. to purchase things they cannot make themselves. Someone to work within the system. An agent, if you will. I am happy to help. My life as a courier was empty and shallow. Ah. Now I'm helping a great race rebuild itself. So now she's the bug liaison. Can you tell me where the Rachni are? I'm afraid not. I don't even have that information myself any longer. After I met the Rachni Queen, that information was removed. It's not painful, but I simply don't remember. I'll remember when I need to. And her caution is understandable. The galaxy isn't yet ready for the return of the Rachni. I got that she was grateful. What else was her message saying? That the first Rachni war was a mistake. Something soured the voices of her people. In Rachni psychology, that would be like mind control, I think. It doesn't really translate. Anyway, she believes you are fighting the ones who did that. Mm, and the collectors and to help. reapers and stuff. All right, sick. Thank you for giving me that information. I'm glad my friend on Novaria is doing well. Be well, Commander Shepard. You will not see me again. Sick. Okay. That was so random, but that was a nice tie-in from the last game. Made it feel purposeful. That's awesome. Hello. Shepard? The news said you were dead. What happened? No, wait, probably classified. Forget I asked. You just have to lie. It's been a couple of years. I'm Gianna Parasini, Novaria Internal Affairs. Yes! You nail Administrator Analeas. Fuck that guy, I sure did. It was my pleasure. Happy to help. What happened to Administrator We hate Analeas? that guy. He made the one mistake Novaria won't tolerate. He got caught taking their money. Good. He's doing a few years in white collar prison. More importantly, he won't work in the field again. Sit down. If I remember right, I owe you a beer. Heck yeah, I already love this town. Everyone comes down to hang out with the Asaris. What brings you to Ilium? Because they're chill. Yeah, that you can talk about. I'm working on a top secret project. Mostly putting together a team and doing research right we now. We should ask her to join us. Sounds vague. No offense taken. I've been undercover enough to Much know Much better how than goes. Ashley. Hey, listen, I just remembered something. I've got to go. Talk to you later. And don't forget to drink your beer. Oh. That was a weird, like, flag done. Examine the beer. Shepard had to leave. Target saw me. Couldn't break cover. A sorry merchant smuggling schematics from Novaria. Can you talk her into showing... Is she showing you good stuff? Oh! She's gonna use me for her little quest, eh? What a sneaky way of... Of, uh... For the best tech upgrades you have. Of course. I can help you with the consult and figure out what options work for you. I introducing a sneaky new side quest. Welcome! You look like someone who needs high-quality equipment. Feel free to look around. My store has the best tech and biotic equipment on Ilium. That stuff might be- oh, you were being watched? Pfft, I'm not a tattletale. How do I know this stuff is any good? You're an Asari. 
Maybe your stuff is no good for humans. I carry nothing but the best. I offer a money-back guarantee. That doesn't help when I'm dead due to equipment failure. Look, I'm dropping too many credits to screw around here. Well, perhaps I could give you a preferred rate at the kiosk. Here, a small discount, and when I get special items in, you can take a look. What kind of special items are we talking about? Oh, you know, schematics, designs, nothing illegal, but I may not have all the licenses to sell them. Do you have anything else? Anything not listed on your main merchandise kiosk? Well, there is one thing. Very advanced design. Not publicly available yet. Oof. That's because it's still in development on Avaria, and illegal for export. Hello, Hermia. Parasini, you set me up! But this isn't Novaria. You don't have the authority to arrest me. I don't care whether you go to jail. I've got all the evidence I need to find you out of business. What about the schematic? Can I still get that, though? Do you have the authority to seize the schematic she's trying to sell? I don't have to. Hermia was under suspicion. We leaked a faulty device to her. All this thing will oh. ever do is blow up in your face. Darn. I, I need to go. I have to talk to my lawyer. Talk fast, Hermia. When the fines hit, you won't be able to afford him. Ah, <laughs> oh, that was good. I'm going to file a few papers. Come by my table when you've got a minute. Wow. Our first time meeting each other in forever, and she had a mission for me. Oh my. I have 246,000. Doubles the time limit for bypass? Ooh, that could help me with my stress level so I don't go bald. Plus 10 biotic damage. Medical. Kestrel helmet. Headshot damage by 5. Weapon by 3. Shield by 3. Torso. Oh, just some nice armor. Okay, well, we're gonna buy... Ooh, it's so expensive. I'm buying it. Fuck it. What's this? And this... I need more time. I don't like being stressed. Alright. We got the biotic damage plus ten percent increase. I need minimal heat increase. And speed. I have extremely high performance requirements. Certainly, sir. Safe too. I need a 100% safety guarantee of anything going on to my suit. Meh. Hermia is going to be a very poor woman very shortly. <sighs> Thanks for the help, That makes me feel great. I love nailing Asari. So ageless and superior. Then you get them and they squeal like schoolgirls. It must be nice having a job that you really enjoy. I wanted to be a cop or C-Sec, but my family had bills. I needed the money a corporate job brought in. Besides, in this job, you don't see things that make it hard to sleep at night. White-collar crime is nice and clean. Hell, at least this time I didn't have to wear heels and a dress. Huh. How'd you end up on Novaria, anyway? Scholarship program and a competitive internship. Turned out I was only middling at the science, but I could always ferret out secrets. You grow up poor and surrounded by rich kids, you get good at hiding yourself. Helps with going undercover. What's up next for you? Research. We've had some hacking attacks. A lot of people are suddenly interested in dark energy. That'll hold me over until I have to go back undercover anyway. It must be hard going undercover so often. It's not so bad. Go new places, be new people. The only weird part is when you go home and try to talk to people and you forget how to react. Like it's another cover, <sighs> you know? Hmm. Deep down, part of you likes fooling people. That's what makes you good at it. Part of me, yeah. I grew up poor and working class. Yeah. Now I walk around the rich and powerful, taking notes, getting evidence. And they never see me coming. All right. It's been a pleasure, Gianna. Glad you're enjoying your life. Doing whatever Thank you're you doing. Shepherd. See you around. Huh. I mean, she seems to be doing well. Administration. Development for human expansion as the colony on horizon has been attacked. Hello, Commander Shepard. Liara will be pleased to see you. As a possible indication of attacks on humans I, galaxy wide. I already heard that people respect her, and then she's like I'll a secretary. I don't really care. Of course, Commander. 
I'm sure it was a riveting conversation. I'm ready to see our girl. Have you faced an Asari commando unit before? Few humans have. Hey, oh, yo! Simple. Either you pay me, or I flay you alive. With my mind. Shepard! Nixeris, hold my calls. My sources said you were alive, but I never believed. It's very good to see you. Aww. It's good to see you too, Liara. How are you doing? I'm doing well. I've been working as an information broker. It's paid the bills since you... Well, for the past two years. And now you're back. Gunning for the Collectors with Cerberus. <laughs> You're well informed. Isn't her job being an information broker not to be a dick, but... If you know that, then you know that I could use your help. I can't, Shepard. I'm sorry. I have commitments here. Things I need to take care of. Then give me intel. What kind of things do you need to take care of? Are you in trouble? Yeah, come with us. No trouble. But it's been a long two years. I had things to do while you were gone. I have debts to repay. I'll pay him off, baby girl. Listen, if you want to help, I need someone with hacking expertise. Someone I can trust. Tally. If you could disable security at key points around Ilium, you could get me information I need. That would help me a great deal. I love the early 2000s thin eyebrows. What's this all about, Liara? Can't you just talk to me? Don't you think I want to, Shepard? This isn't because I don't trust you. This is Ilium. Anything I say is probably being recorded. All right. If it'll help you, I'll take care of it. When you hack one, a server will open somewhere nearby for a short time. You can download data from there if you hurry. Thank you, Shepard. This may help me pay a great debt. There's an Asari named Samara here on Ilium. Do you know where I could find her? Samara? Yes. She arrived recently and registered with tracking officer Dara. You can find Dara at the transportation hub. Why would Samara have to register with a tracking officer? Is she a criminal? No. In fact, she's quite the opposite. Samara is a Justicar, one of an ancient sect of Asari warriors. Dara can tell you more. Okay, what about Thane? for Thane Krios. He's supposed to be here on Ilium. The assassin? Yes. He arrived here a few days ago. My sources tell me he may be targeting a corporate executive, Nisana Dantius. He contacted a woman named Serena. Serena. So many new names. I'm not tracking at all. Perhaps she can tell you where. Krios okay, we need is. to go to Serena. That was all just off the top of your head. I'm a very good information broker, Shepard. The world of intrigue isn't that different from a dig site, except that the dead bodies still smell. <laughs> Thanks for the help. Jesus. To know. Of course. If there's anything else I can help you with. Let me know. I mean, she's like pretty badass too. She's got a lot of things going for her. Garrus grew out of his shell. She grew out of her shell to become a uh, intel info lady. How's your own work going? Everyone needs information, Shepard. You want to know why I don't drop everything to join you? I need to get that data. It should be about friendship or trust. But that's not the way it works on Ilium. Let mm. me know when you hack those terminals. Give me that, and I can talk to you. All right. If it'll help when you me. hack one. Yep. Thank you, Shepard. This may help me pay a great debt. Yeah. All right. I'll talk to you later, Liara. So we've got 500 things to do. We have to go talk to Serena in the cargo transfer. We've got the Miranda mission with her sexy twin. We've got the assassin. So many things. Listen, I know the data is vital to the Kurosa family. The Santa. Dantius didn't give us time to pack. I'm lucky I got out at all. For mercenaries were starting to shoot. That's a name I just heard. Let's us back in. I'll get it. I promise. If not, well, 
We'll just have to hope. We've already got 10 missions. What's another? Excuse me, I'm on an important call. Okay, I'll go fuck myself. Anyone else? Anyone else? Any missions? We're already doing every single mission in the galaxy. Do you get anyone else? You guys need anything? Ladies, you doing all right? A snack? Maybe? Some water? You, you need anything? Oh, Serena! Serena? Who wants to know? Name's Shepard. Liara Tassoni said you might have information on Thane Krios. We got a laundry list. Tana, cover for me. Yeah, let's go. We got knowledge. Yeah, I know who Thane Krios is. I might have passed him some information, but I didn't hire him. What do you want to know? Maybe you could help me find him. <laughs> I can tell you, but you won't stop him. When he contacted me, I checked up on him. The man never gives up on a That's job. That's what they all say. I ran security for Nasana Dantius. Then I found out she was having people killed to cover up her dirty secrets. That would be awful. She fired me when I confronted her. Her loss. I might have been good enough to stop Thane from taking her down. Hmm. If you work there, you must have an idea what his opposition will be. Eclipse Mercs. High-tech killer. Undisciplined, but very well equipped. They don't much care who they kill, as long as they're paid for it. Thane has quite a reception waiting for him. I told him all I knew. He didn't seem worried. Why does that name sound familiar? She was a representative on the Citadel a few years ago. Right. She had me kill her sister, the slaver. Oh! That was just a rumor. Well, you know what she's capable of then. She has even more power here in Nos Astra. That chick. She uses it to keep her friends in check and her enemies dead. Oh! So where do I find Thane? The Dantius Towers. Penthouse level of Tower 1. Sheesh! There's a second tower, still under construction. If Thane is smart, he'll go in from there. Do you have access? It doesn't sound like Nasana is just gonna let Yeah, he's in. not a very open guy. Or she's, she's not an open she is paranoid. chick. No one's getting in or out of there without a fight. I can get you in, but you'll only get one shot. One you opportunity. Do you know anything else about Thane? Not much. He did say that he's not doing the hit for money. Nobody hired him. <laughs> I wanted to know who I was helping, and he said he's doing this job on his own. That he had to restore the balance of his life. I don't know. Maybe he's crazy. If he takes down Nasana, I don't care why he does it. You're just offering your help. No strings attached. You're going to look for Thane. Nasana's mercenaries will try to stop you. At the least, you'll distract her guards. Take a little fire, give Thane a clear shot. Mm. I didn't hire him to kill Nasana, but I won't shed any tears when she gets what's coming to her. <laughs> I'm ready. Let's go then. Good. I'm tired of this crap. We'll go tonight as soon as the shift workers clear out of Tower 2. I like Serena. Yeah, buddy. Uh, we'll just keep Miranda since, like, she has stuff to do on this planet. I think I'm just gonna keep the same crew. I don't really... Sure. Towers are heavily guarded and you'll oh, find this is dope. closer to the penthouse. So, this assassin, you planning to stop him? I'm just here to make sure he survives. Hmm. There they are, the Dantius Towers. You'll have to get up to the second tower and cross the bridge to the penthouse. Her mercs will fight you every step, but it's your best chance. Why don't we just save time and take the shuttle up? She's got mercs with rockets just waiting for you to try. Mm. You get maybe halfway up before they shot you down. Besides, your assassin won't go in that way. Best to go in low. All right. All right. Let's do this. Hold on. Ooh, I'm getting excited. Oh, God. Don't linger too long. They'll be here to greet you soon enough. Good luck, Shepard. Oh no! Oh! 
Not the eye dogs. Loki mech. Like my kitty? They're so good. They've been sleeping all day. Help. You're still alive? I can't feel my legs. My chest is killing me. Who attacked you? Aww. We're just night workers. Nasana sent them after us. She sent the mechs to round us up, but we didn't hear. They just started shooting. They just attacked you? Yes. They were too slow. Aww. It was horrible. Everyone screaming. What the heck? Lex said there was no time. Asana wanted us out of the way immediately. Then <coughs> the dogs. <coughs> I can't hear. That should ease the pain and keep you alive until help arrives. Really? This guy? Why? Take your time. Aww. I think I'm better. Just rest. Find the other workers. Help them. I need to get up to the pet house. Any suggestions? Take the service elevator to the upper floors. Hmm. The bridge between the towers isn't finished, but if you're careful, watch out for the mercs. They're everywhere. Any idea how many mercs Nissana's got? A lot. Dozens of them are wandering around Ooh. here all day. You'll find more the further up you go. Why would Nisana kill her own workers? Paranoia? They were expendable, but I didn't realize she was that ruthless. Aww. My friends, co-workers, slaughtered. They were jumping off ledges to escape the dogs. That's awful. Jesus. I'll do what I can. Thank you. Let's get moving. Let's say elite vanguard. Critical system damage. Rerouting power system failing. Eclipse vanguard. <laughs> Punch that dog. Let's go. Yeah, right on your ass. Yeah, right on your ass. Let's go, Grunt. I'm already here with the witty commentary. I love to see it. Let's go. Jesus Christ! Oh my god. Come here, buddy. It's all over now. Hey. <laughs> Here we go. Hey, I think he went in here. We'll go get him. You go. 
get your ass in there, and if that is not paying you to stand around. Hostile forces have engaged. Oh, Jesus. Requesting. Here we go. Excuse me. Taking fire. Impact shot. Anything interesting out here? Just a vault door thing? Oop. Okay, we're gonna go there first. I got it. Wee! Ah! Maybe a bad choice. Maybe a bad choice. Nah, we're good. Dead? Okay. Double tap. Yeah, right on your ass. This is so much fun. This is awesome. This reminds me of Cyberpunk. Oh god. There we go. Come on. Almost there. Oh god, it's crawling. I hate that. Ow! these guys first. There we go. Holy heck. There we go. There we go. There we go. Jesus. Oops. Thank you for following my direct order. Mm, we're just gonna go in. Send it. I got a feeling that elevator isn't coming down empty. Mm. We should get behind stuff. <laughs> right. Sorry. Ah, elevators. What a callback. We're gonna have some news playing while we go. Very slowly. Damn it. Have you seen the assassin? Why are you looking for him? You're not one of the Santa's mercs. Who are you? You got two ways down, express or coach. You <laughs> choose. Look, pal. Even if I knew where he was, I wouldn't tell you. Not the answer I was looking for. 
I've got nothing more to say to you. If you shoot me, my team's right through. <laughs> How about goodbye? <laughs> Anyways, I have no ammo, dude. Genetic information for the Carosa family. Salarian looking for the Carosa family. Oh, okay. Um. I have no ammo. I'm gonna have to melee these bitches. That works. We're gonna have to get crafty. It's time. All right in here. Get back. Get back. I'll shoot. Oh, got it. Drop the gun, lizard. <laughs> I don't want to hurt you, but I will. Hurt me? I hardly felt a thing. Tell him. No. And easy. He's my brother. I just want to see if he's all right. No. Are you the ones who shot the Merc? It wasn't me. Your brother didn't do it? No. Talon was standing here with me. What happened exactly? The Merc found us and shouted at us to move. We, we panicked, and he shouted more. I thought he was going to kill us, then his head just exploded. What? Talon picked up the Merc's gun, but we were too afraid to leave. Then you showed up. That's very precise shooting. Yeah. How safe is that bridge out there? The bridge is stable, but the wind's your real problem. If it doesn't throw you off, the mercs will definitely try. There's Wind. A lot of them out there. I'm looking for someone. Probably the guy who killed this merc. Talon thought he saw someone following us, but he's been a bit on edge. I haven't seen anyone but the mercs. Is the bridge the only way to the penthouse and the other tower? From here, yeah. It won't be easy. Mercs are patrolling the other side. Whatever Nasana's hiding from must be pretty scary. There are still mercs up here. You should get to the lower levels. No need to convince me. Yeah. Helen, come on, get up. Aww. Can we go home now? Yeah, we're getting out of here. You're just protecting you. his brother. I punched him in the head. Green, white, white, orange. Orange, white, orange. Sick. Punch that guy. 6,000 credits. Nice. All right, bridge time. Heavy weapon ammo. Yes. And a Viper sniper rifle. Nice. It's about time. What's going on down there? I'm afraid your men aren't able to respond, Nisana. Time to reunite. Yelling is a good sign. Yeah, right on your ass. That works. Missiles are no joke. I'll tear you apart. No one expects to be punched in this game. Ooh, choose your loadout. I like what we've got. I never do that, man. I just have a good time. 
Oh shit. Enemies in front. <clears throat> Taking heavy fire. Hmm. Let's go. There we go. Boop. Punch. I'll punch you too. Yeah, uh huh. Try getting that gun out. Oh. It's just so efficient. I don't know, man. Oh, wow. Orange, white. Oh, it was up there. Fuck. Orange, large, white. White, orange, white. Oh, getting down to the nitty gritty. Ooh, twelve thousand. This and a submachine gun damage upgrade. Nice, good haul. We're compromised. I'll punch him. I don't care what you do. Now I'm going to cross that bridge. Power system is rallying power. Boopy. Grenadiers. Whoa, that's ballsy. I did not mean to climb on top of that. Yay! Good. Sorry, Loki. Are you okay? He just jumped out of his little. I couldn't see. There was glare on my monitor, honestly. I don't care what you do. No one can cross that bridge. Keeping hostile. This might have been a bad idea. I wanted to start blasting. We're good. I see you. Yes. What the hell are you waiting for? I don't see its health. Howie. What? On the 
on the ground. Whoa! Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay. Barriers up. Yeah, right on your ass. This is not great. Positioning. Especially because of that fucking thing. She needs to stop. She's really wrecking my chili. Can I just... Tear you apart! You're really making me mad. Nobody runs. Jesus. Got her. Zero ammo. Shepard, but you're dead. I got better. I got better? Now you're here to kill me. Maybe I just missed you. Screw you, Shepard. Charming as ever. I'm sure you find this all very ironic. First you take care of my sister, and now you're here for me. Not really. Well, you made it this far. Now what? I'm not an assassin, Nasana. But I'm looking for one. You break in here and decimate my security just to find the person who's here to kill me? What are you playing at, Shepard? I hear the ceiling what? noises. I heard something. Damn it. Check the other entrances. You stay put. When I'm finished dealing with this nuisance, you and I are going to... Oh my god, it's the guy from Hellboy! What's his name? The fish man? Wow. Well, that was fast. So this is our guy. Good. Abe. It's Abe. You ignoring me? Clingy girlfriend. Behavior. It came a long way to talk to you. One moment. Prayers for the wicked must not be forsaken. Okay. She certainly was wicked. Not for her. For me. Dude, Abe's had a glow up. Individual can be difficult to discern by actions alone. Take you, for instance. All this destruction, chaos. I was curious to see how far you'd go to find me. Well, here I am. Kay? How'd you know I was coming at all? I didn't. Not until you marched in the front door and started shooting. Haha. <laughs> Nasana had become paranoid. You saw the strength of her guard force. She believed one of her sisters would kill her. Little did she know I was gonna be an assassin. You were a valuable distraction. Let's cut to the chase. I need you for a mission. Indeed. You're familiar with the Collectors? By reputation. They're abducting entire human colonies. Freedom's progress was their handiwork. I see. We're going after them. Attacking the Collectors would require passing through the Omega-4 Relay. No ship has ever returned from doing so. Yeah, it's they kind of the it's catch. Suicide mission. I intend to prove them wrong. A suicide mission. Huh. 
Yes. A suicide mission will do nicely. <laughs> this guy's a freak. He's got a little butt chin, too. I'm dying. Oh. Low survival odds don't concern me. The abduction of your colonists does. You're dying. Are you contagious? How long do you have? If you're interested, we can discuss it on your ship. The problem isn't contagious, and it won't affect my work. Can Morden help? I take it that means you're on the team? I will work for you, Shepard. No charge. Wow. That was easy. Maybe Morden can fix him. Morden wants to help Joker. I don't know. Stay in Krios for your team, but medically questionable unless mission is resolved quickly. Legal representatives dealing with public damage to Dantius, Dantius Towers. The Viper sniper rifle. Military sniper rifle. Hell yeah. Submachine gun damage. Upgrade available. And we made $48,000 to make up for some of the minor spending we did. Minor spending we did. Dude, we did a lot. <laughs> I've heard impressive stories, Krios. Sounds like you'll be an asset to the team. That is, if you're comfortable having an assassin watch your back. I've accepted a contract. My arm is Shepard's. Dude, this guy's badass. Uh, don't know about you, but I'm loyal to more than my next paycheck. Obviously he is too. He's doing this mission gratis. What's your concern? I don't like mercenaries. An assassin is just a precise mercenary. An assassin is a weapon. A weapon doesn't choose to kill. The one who wields it does. Where shall I put my things? I'd prefer someplace dry if anything is available. Huh. The area near the life support plant on the crew deck tends to be slightly more arid than the rest of the ship. Oh! Yeah. That place I couldn't go to. Oh, thanks. Thane. Ah! He seems quite civil. We need all the help we can get. He's not what I expected in an assassin. He may surprise you. Unless it's a front. Yeah. And he may not. We'll see. I don't know. That's sick. So we got Thane. We met Liara, reunited. We still need to get her, like, intel shit. We still need to... God, there's so much. We need to do the calm... Whatever, the, the terminal mission for Liara. And then we need to get Megan's sister, <laughs> Melissa, whatever the shit her name is, Margaret, and then feed the fish, feed the fish, and then recruit the other person that's there. Dude, we got a long list. I want to look at this life support room first, though. Life support. Ah. Hello. Do you need something? Have a few minutes to talk? Certainly. We haven't had a chance since I joined. When we met you, you said you were dying. Mm -hmm. Yes. I thought you'd want to know more. Mm -hmm. You don't have to worry about the rest of the crew. My illness is not communicable, even to other Drell. It's called Keppel Syndrome. Are you gonna be all right till the end of the mission? I should be fine for another eight to 12 months. The more time I spend in human environments, the faster it progresses. I think it's safe to say that by the time my body is incapacitated, we'll be victorious or dead. Either way, I won't be a burden to you. What exactly is the problem? My people are native to an arid world. Most of us now live on Kaje, the Hanar homeworld. It's very humid and rains every day. Our mm. lungs can't deal with the moisture. Over time, the tissue loses its ability to absorb oxygen. It becomes harder to breathe. Eventually, we suffocate. Can't they do something about that? The Hanar have funded a genetic engineering program. They should be able to adapt Just them. not right now. The project has only been running for a few years. Mm. I don't believe my body will still draw breath by the time it bears fruit. Is there anything we can do here? Normandy has a state-of-the-art medical bay. No, thank you. It's being attended to. If the finest medical minds in the Hanar illuminated primacy can't solve the problem, 
I doubt your ship's medic could. Thank you for your concern. Trust me, this won't affect my performance. Have you met Morden? Hold on. Pause. I know a guy. I know a lizard. Oh, Morden. Commander, you've received a new message at your private terminal. Hello, Morden. Shepard, how can I help? Are there any medical concerns I should be aware of on the team? Cerberus personnel in excellent, always some matters, but nothing affecting immediate mission. Have you got a minute to talk? Later, updating crew dental records. All Cerberus personnel have cyanide capsules and molars. Primitive ocular nerve flashbangs harder to disarm. Anything else? Okay. Work. We'll That's a negative. <laughs> huh. Tarn. Jack would like to talk with you, Commander. Oh. Appreciate the help. Hey, Shepard, I heard what you did on Ilium and I wanted to thank you for helping out Zeus Hope one more time. We're surviving if barely most of Exogeny left, but I stayed behind as an attache and to make sure that nothing was left of the Thorian. We don't need that problem again. Also, I'm really, really sorry that I shot at you. I'm pretty sure I said that, but I just wanted to reiterate it. Good luck and thanks. Zeus Hope is alive again because of what you did. Elizabeth. Ah! That researcher that was there. Jack. Hello, Jack. It's the cargo bay. This game is so impressive. There are so many details. It's insane. I got thoughts like little bugs crawling in and out of my head. I can't stop them. Oh. You know I have a history with Cerberus. You know how far back it goes? Since you were a child, yeah. Don't listen to anything you have to say, Jack. Your pal, the elusive man, never seen him before, but Cerberus raised me. First thing I remember is my cell door in a Cerberus base. They did experiments, drugged me, tortured me. Whatever chance I had to be normal, they stole it by trying to turn me into some superbiotic. The doctors, the other kids, every one of them hated me. They let me suffer. So this is Eleven from Stranger Things when she grows up. What did they hope to gain by torturing a little girl? It was something about pain breaking down mental barriers and how it might clear the way for a more biotic power. I'm sure there was a payoff due at some point, but I wasn't going to see it. I was wired up in a cell. How did you get out of there? There was some kind of emergency and I made a break for it. The other kids came out of their cells and attacked me. So did the guards. I just killed everything in my way and ran. Guess my biotics had developed faster than they thought. I managed to get a shuttle off the ground. Drifted until a freighter picked me up. The crew used me, then sold me. That's my uplifting escape story. Hmm. There were other children in the base? I didn't know much about them. I was kept separate. They hated me just like everyone else there. When I broke out, I had to fight through them all. I showed them. But there's a loose end I need to deal with. Oh? You're absolutely certain that Cerberus was running the facility? I was a kid, but I wasn't dumb. I know how to listen. It was Cerberus. Don't care how far down the chain it was. Mm. They thought they were so clever. Turns out, mess with someone's head enough and you can turn a scared kid into an all-powerful bitch. Fucking idiots. <laughs> I'm going to talk to the elusive man and he'd better have some answers. He'll just deny everything. Yeah. That's not what I'm after anyway. It's not I gonna found work. Coordinates in your files. I want to go to the Telton facility on Pravia where they tortured and drugged me. I want to go to the center of the place myself. I want to deploy a big fucking bomb and I want to watch from orbit when it goes. Okay. Attacking our allies is gonna derail our mission. Not a smart move. The files say it was shut down after my escape. It's been abandoned for years. They going to care if I blow up a garbage dump? You've lived with this your whole life. Why do this now? Like I said, I found the coordinates in your files. You can't expect me to just sit on information like that. You looked for them. You didn't stumble upon them. It's what you wanted, but... 
I'll set a course for Pragia. I owe you, Shepard. Loyalty mission. Yay! Unlocked! We've got a few to do. We've got to still do, um... Wasn't, like, their Garrus's mission or something? And then we had to do Zaid's mission, and then we got to do her mission? We had a lot of shit to do, but today was very productive overall. Very productive overall, and that is where I'm going to call it. Until next time.